men of God, if you are a dreamer like me, I'm here to encourage you. Let's read in the Bible and find the encouragement. Let's read the book of the uh, Acts of Apostles, chapter 2, verses 17 to 18. It says, God says, In the last days, I will pour out my spirit on all people. Your sons and daughters will prophesy. Your young men will see vision. Your old men will have special dreams. At that time, I will pour out my spirit on my servants, men and women, and they will prophesy. Amen, my friends. The Bible says, there is a time God will pour out His Spirit on us. Then we will see vision, dream, and some others will prophesy. I want to encourage you, if you are and if you have the dreamer, keep, my friends, take care. Always pray God so Satan may not destroy, so Satan may not steal from the gift. I will try to tell you my life experience. One day I made a prayer fasting of a three days. In that day, I was in my house, three days full, not eating, not drinking. That was a special fasting prayer. What God revealed to me, my friend? On 15 to 18, January 2015, in that fasting prayer, God revealed to me so many dreams and the vision. Let me tell you some vision. I was asleep. I saw two Twin men of God came in my room. What they came for? They tell, came to tell me that their brothers will have a wedding. Now, they want me to be in charge of the wedding, to preach and lead the ceremony. In debating with them, it came another man of God also. Also, he needs me to attend the meeting in the army palace. After three minutes, another man of God came also tell me about the president's inauguration and uh, he wished me to be also in that meeting. Now, brothers, I was uh, so confused. I didn't know what to do. But I told my brothers in Christ, brothers, here already three appointments in the same day. As a man of God, let's have a 
agreement and it changed the day so i can know how to live all these three occasions we agree one meeting to be on saturday the inauguration of the president on the sunday the wedding and the monday the meeting at the army palace we agreed like that in a dream let me continue with the story when i woke up morning i meditated the dream in meditating the dream i didn't find a solution now i took my phone and the phone one of my close friends apostle mavumba peter and i explained to him all the dream and he told me god himself knows what he want to you later on i found again another pastor in empangin pastor steve then i told him also the dream he appreciated the dream and he say thanks very much for this type is of dream i continue looking for other men of god i went in town and i meet a group of other servants then i let the dream the dream then they told me may god be glorified with your vision i kept quiet then it come to pass one month i was in my house around 5 my phone ring i saw the number of uh, pastor warren then i took the phone and the answer he told me pastor chris we have a meeting at the church the methodist church all the pastors who are attending the south african police devotion will be day we have thing to talk on then i say pastor thanks for the message morning i woke up and i prepared myself and i went to attend that meeting i attended the meeting everything was okay to finish with the baking that meeting 